All right, welcome back to this Chargers franchise. Week 17 against the Los Angeles Rams. And we're currently 8-7, the seventh seed in the AFC playoff picture. The Rams are 7-8. and eight. I started this off from, I think, week 13 or something like that. So, yeah, the record's going to be very different from real life. But we're dealing with a lot of injuries. Austin Eckler will not be playing in this game. Yep, Austin Eckler got hurt last game against the Colts. I was unaware. And we will be starting Isaiah Spiller because Joshua Kelly is also hurt. So our backfield is going to consist of Isaiah Spiller and Sony Michelle. Not great, so we're going to have to rely heavily on the passing game. And I have switched to playing only offense. I am not going to play defense anymore because I suck at defense and I do not enjoy it. Anyways, let's get into it and hope the CPU defense can all ball out. And we immediately get the ball. I'm going to switch this play to the right. Can I do that? Uh, no, I cannot. All right. So Isaiah Spiller, his first run of the day is a big one. Gain of 13 yards. First run for the rookie, Isaiah Spiller. All right, second. I mean, first down. We're going to go with a little play action here. And Bobby Wagner, as I try to get rid of it, wouldn't let me, is going to blitz. And they get a sack third. I mean, second and 18. Uh, I think we're going to run another play action and hope that. Does Bobby Wagner have an X Factor? Why does this man have an X Factor? He hasn't been bad this year, but he hasn't been X Factor good this year. Um, uh, just run for Herbert, get some yards. We get about four there. Here is the injury report. So Joey Bosa and Rayshon Slater, they say they have no injuries, but they can't play. So I don't know what's going on there. But we got a third and fourteen here. No protection in the backfield. And Gerald Everett. Big reception. He's still going down to about the 32, 41-yard reception. First pass of the game for Herbert to Gerald Everett is a big one. And we're going to go back on the ground and see if we can gain some sort of big yardage. Again, Isaiah Spiller is going to get stopped for a gain of one. He's going to go for another run. I see a possible gap on that left side. Uh, I expect a decent game from Spiller today, and he so far is not disappointed with three rushes and 21 yards. We're going to switch this to the right side, third and two. This would be a big conversion if we can get it, and we do. Spiller for a whole lot more, eight-yard gain. First and ten, and Mike Dub is going to be my primary target on this play. Let's see if he can get separation. He does not, but Keenan Allen breaks through. I thought, thank God, whoever number 22 is, he wasn't paying attention. That could have easily been a pick there. But Joshua Palmer distracted him just enough for Keenan Allen to break free open on that play. Uh, we're going to go with the slant pass here. And Keenan Allen wide open. We strike first in the end zone for the touchdown. And the Rams immediately not wasting time. They do not have Baker Mayfield. They have Matthew Stafford. Their team is fully healthy in this. They did not waste any time coming down to score, but Isaiah Spiller is putting up a clinic right now. Five rushes, 35 yards. Um, yeah, I think I'm going to pass on this play. Uh, this is not a great formation. And Gerald Everett going to get the quick reception for the first down. Oh, Keenan Allen touchdown on the jet sweep. I did not expect to score on that play. Keenan Allen, second touchdown of the day, one in the air. And I think, does that count as a rushing touchdown? Stiff arms, Jalen Ramsey gets by Bobby Wagner and beats the defender to get in the end zone. But once again, the Rams answer right back with another touchdown of their own. We have ourselves a fight. Isaiah Spiller, another big run. That one for about seven and we get a second and three. Um, I'm going to, yeah, let's go with the pass here. Keenan Allen should not. Ooh, that was a tough pass. Leaves to a third down. Uh, I think I'm going to trust Spiller on the ground here to convert this and see if he can get it. And he is going to trucks Jalen Ramsey for the first down. We have been driving down the field on this possession, and we have made it all the way to the 14-yard line, looking to strike again. And I'm going to give it up to Gerald Everett. He's going to get a little bit there, probably like one yard. I probably could have got more if I ran there. 
But to avoid a fumble, I'd rather not. Uh, we got a second and nine now. Right before the two-minute warning, we can get a playoff. Uh, I'm going to run it with Herbert. I'm going to run it with Herbert. Slide. And that's going to be the two-minute warning. Third down. Third and two. Uh, they want us to... Hmm. Yeah, I'll pass it. But if I get in trouble here... Probably got Herbert. Isaiah Spiller in the air for a touchdown. He's been dominant on the ground, posting nine rushes of 65 yards. And he gets his first touchdown through the air. I believe that's his first TD of the season, if I'm not mistaken. And we go back up by seven. And the defense comes up big with a stop. And now we can try and drive down the field with two timeouts and possibly get a field goal and add to this lead as that doesn't go for much. All right, quick third and seven here. Gerald Everett got kind of bumped on a route where he was going to be wide open. But Isaiah Spiller right now is the player of the game getting the first down. And let's run that play right again. I think he's going to get wide open again. Uh, no, they counter it. But Gerald Everett immediately with the separation. Let's see. Just trying to run out this clock, getting as many yards as possible. Gerald Everett. He, him and Spiller, two unsung heroes so far in this game. All right, we did call our last timeout and kick a field goal. And the Rams answer right back with the field goal of their own. Cut it back to a one possession game. Back and forth we go in this battle for LA. Can we be successful? That's a risky pass when McKitty gets it over Bobby Wagner. Herbert, only 169 yards. But he has been slinging only two incompletions. Second and eight here. Keenan Allen. He's going to catch it. But we're going to end up losing a yard as Herbert got hit on the play. Third and nine. Can we convert? Mike Williams and Keenan Allen have been kind of no-shows. As it's been the uh, Gerald Everett show. But Mike Williams answers back with a quick reception of his own. Two catches, 29 yards. But yeah, Gerald Everett's got six catches, 90 yards on the day. He has been dominant as our main weapon. And so has this man, Isaiah Spiller, with another reception. And Spiller, can he beat Ramsey? He does. And he was so close to that touchdown. I should have just dove for it. Isaiah Spiller, what a performance for the rookie. Here, in Austin Eckler's absence, he is going to get stopped short. 12 rushes, 111 yards. This man, he's already got a touchdown in the air. Doesn't have one on the ground, though. But, man, what a game he is playing. And Keenan Allen. Oh, that was Mike Williams. Never mind. Mike Williams is going to get an end zone. His first touchdown of the game. That's now two for Allen, one for Williams, and one for Spiller. And we are back up. By, I believe, 14. And boy, our defense answers right back. No score for the Rams. Aaron Donald does have his X-Factor, though, somehow. But the Rams do not score. And I'm going to just kick it out to Gerald Everett. He's going to get hit immediately. And that is going to end up taking us to the end of the third quarter. Oh, never mind. That's only halftime. Why did I think that was the end of the third quarter, bro? I was about to say, this is a really quick game. No, that was just the end of halftime. No, that was the end of the third. What the hell just happened? Hold on. Yeah, that was the end of the third quarter. Why did it have me do my adjustments then? That's weird. I don't know why that happened. It was the end of the third quarter. I'm not tripping. I thought I was going crazy for a second. Well, nonetheless, we got a third and uh, two here. Yeah, that kind of that messed me up a bit. I, I was about to say, this is a quick game. Isaiah, goddamn Spiller, man. What a game. First and ten after the Spiller run. This man has been absolutely electric so far in his first career start. And he's going to continue that with this reception as he stiff arms long. That, nope, that's a wrap. I don't know the damn Rams cornerbacks. But he stiff arms and down. Only 200 passing yards. I think he has over that. I don't think that's it. But Isaiah Spiller, bro. 48 yards in the air. Over 100 yards on the ground. As he's going to go nowhere on that one. As we get a third and five here. This is, would be a big win. If we could get it. And let's see what we can do here. Mike Williams. Great route ran by him. Gets us the first down. Herbert's 23 of 25. 219 yards. And three 
touchdowns, I believe, on the game here. Uh, not as many yards as I expected him, but I mean, I've thrown it a fair amount of times as Spiller is going to get stopped in the backfield for the first time in this game. And that is going to be a second and 13. Uh, Sony Michelle comes in the game for us. Uh, we're going to run four verts, see if we can get maybe a Keenan Allen or whatever open on here. And we're going to get none of them. Sony Michelle will go with the safe option up the middle. He gets the first down easily. I have a feeling if we score here, the game will be more than over. As there's only four minutes left in uh, this game. And the Rams are down by 14. So quick match would say, yeah, the game would be over. And Justin Herbert get the first down. I was going to run out of bounds, but why not? Herbert using his legs. Three rushes, 24 yards. Let's keep the ball moving in the air. Let's try and ice this game up. Momentum is in our favor, all of it. And over the middle, ooh, throw out of the sack, but he still gets the pass. He completes it. Herbert to Keenan. What a pass. Getting taken down, moving up in the pocket. He still completes it. And Keenan Allen's got 37 yards on the day. We'll move it, go up the middle with Sonny Michelle. His first carry of the day goes for about one. Isaiah Spiller comes back at the game. Uh... Let's see if we can get anything going on the slant route. Uh, Mike Williams is going to get open over the middle. And that is going to be down to the four-yard line. 26 for 28 for Herbert on the day. And we are in scoring range here at the four-yard line. Can we get in with Spiller? Can we get him a rushing touchdown on the game? It's looking promising here. Isaiah Spiller may get into the um, end zone for the second time. And he does this time on the ground. Isaiah Spiller, player of the game, first start of his career, and it is electric. And this game is definitely going to be over. As they turn the ball over, I'm assuming, since we got the ball all the way at their 33-yard line, Isaiah Spiller, change the direction. That's going to be a 7-yard gain. Second rushing defense in the league. We are probably, the I think, the worst rushing offense or second worst rushing offense in the league. And clearly, that's not the case. With my man Spill over here just absolutely torching them, the Rams had no answer for the Los Angeles Chargers as they are most likely going to be eliminated, I think, now from playoff contention with this loss. And we have a chance to move up in the bracket as Spiller. Loss of yardage there. I keep it on the ground. Why not? Let's just run out this clock. And yeah, this is going to be a huge win to move us to 9-7 on the year. See if we can get to 10-7. and seven. Isaiah Spiller is going to be short of the first down. And we'll settle for the field goal. And with that, the Rams quickly scored, used all their timeouts. And we are going to end up going into victory formation. Big win against our in-state rival, Los Angeles Rams. And we clearly own this stadium as we're going to win 41 to 25 final score we move to 9 and 7 on the season the rams fall to 7 and 9 and that leaves one more game left against the Denver Broncos for final seeding to see where we'll be placed in the NFL playoffs final box score herbert what a game 26 for 28 258 yards three touchdowns no turnovers stafford had himself a good game with 12 for 22 207 yards and two touchdowns and the story of this game isaiah spiller 21 carries 140 rushing yards with a touchdown on the ground and in the air. Cam Akers had himself a game. 13 attempts, 118 yards in a TD. Really good game from Cam Akers. Oh, yeah, Keenan Allen. It was a rushing touchdown. You can't forget that. His first rushing touchdown of the year. Uh, Receiving-wise, uh, Cooper Cup did Cooper Cup things. Gerald Everett was our leading receiver. Uh, let's go to our team. Uh, Gerald Everett, 95 yards. No touchdowns, though. Mike Williams, 5 catches, 55 yards in a TD. Isaiah Spiller. 48 yards in the air and a touchdown. He deserves Offensive Player of the Week. Um, Keenan Allen had a touchdown in the air as well. And let's see how our defense did without me playing. Uh, Taco Charlton had a sack, and that's really about it. That's all um, our defense did. Kenneth Murray, five tackles. Uh, tackles for loss, Michael Davis, Khalil Mack, and Sebastian Joseph Day. So that's going to be it for me. Leave a like, guys, enjoy. Subscribe, guys, are new. GG.